Alright guys, next thing we're going to do is we're going to have the Vizio touchscreen controlling the Tweedo Sweet PLC, which will essentially turn on our forward and reverse contactors below. So, you can see here that I've got the Tweedo Sweet program. This is our forward reverse. I've got some additional contacts in here. So I've got two stops in series here, and I've got two starts in parallel here for my forward. So my stop right here, check this out. When I change the stop push button on my touch screen, then it changes on the PLC. That's huge. Let me tell you, that is huge. It has taken me like two or three months to try and figure out how to get the touch screen to talk to the PLC and how have everything integrated. Um, there is very little from Schneider on the internet that I have found. Um, so I have been watching lots of YouTube videos uh, from gentlemen in the Philippines and Portugal and guys who have set this up, you know, bits and pieces and trying to put it all together. So what I'm trying to do now is to back engineer what I've done and split it up into like piecemeal parts that we can put into different videos so that I can go back to it in a couple of months when I forget exactly what I did. And you guys, if you're setting up the Tweedo Suite and the Magellus HMI, you'll be able to set it up as well. Okay, so that is huge. The fact that I can press a button on my touchscreen and have that change real time on my PLC. Okay, so this one right here is just a simulation just so I can put everything in the same video right here rather than doing a picture in picture of my actual touchscreen. But this is exactly the same as the touchscreen that is sitting beside me. So when I hit this forward push button, it will go to this HMI input right here. There will be continuity of logic and the contactor should turn on beside me. Oh yes. Okay, when I let go of that push button, then it changes state again right here. So you can see here that my forward push button is providing that input to the PLC. I now have logic continuity, for, so my forward contactor is on. And now in order to stop that forward contactor, I can hit my physical stop push button, or I can hit my virtual stop push button, being this guy right here. So when I hit this, it will change the state of that HMI input, stop the logic continuity to the contactor, and turn it off. Oh yes. Excellent. Press it again, and it goes back to its rest state here, and now I'm ready to hit the forward push button again, and turn on the contactor. Beautiful. Okay, so the next series of uh, videos are going to be how do you set up each of these push buttons on here? How do you, in this case, like when I hit the start, you can see that it changes state right here. So this light actually changes state whenever I hit any of those push buttons. So how do you have that happen? How do you have the touch screen talking to your computer through Ethernet? And then how do you have that link back into your PLC? to ultimately control your contactors. So we'll start off setting up the, the video and building up each of these push buttons. We'll have it just control the lights on the actual touchscreen, and then we'll build into the configurations on the Visio and the Tweedo Suite in order to have everything talk together. So let's start off with the Visio designer. 